<laughs> Ezekiel, this is kind of like y'all's last bow, you know, for this 2014 team. Does it kind of feel like that too? That uh, you kind of put 2014 a little bit in the rearview mirror after this, or what, what's your sense on that? I mean, I, th I think our team have already done that. You know, and that, that's something that the coaches emphasized that last year was last year, and uh, it's a new year now, and uh, this off season has just been a grind, and uh, we've been grinding, so you know, we can have similar results next year. How have you balanced this kind of stuff, the fun stuff, with the work? Um, you know, you just got to know what's more important and you got to put the work first. And uh, I mean, obviously, like, we don't get to miss workouts. So, you know, we've made, done our makeup workouts on Saturday mornings. And, uh, you know, uh, Coach Mick definitely keeps, make sure he keeps us on, on our pedestal. Just about uh, the work ethic you mentioned, what, is there something unique this year that you all have attempted to, to do that's different from your years here in the past? Something that, that is unique to this team and moving forward? I think something that the uh, coaches did a great job at just kind of like knocking us off our pedestal basically after after we won a national championship. You know, and, uh, Coach Big has definitely grinded us harder than he's grinded us the years before, just making sure that, that we know that we still have more to accomplish and uh, just to keep our eyes on the track. How, how difficult that has the workouts been this uh, off season? the grind? Uh, how hard have you guys been going after? I mean, every off season is just brutal, you know, body aching, just a, it's just different, uh, I mean, it's terrible, honestly, but, <laughs> uh, it's worth it at the end. Ezekiel, you're used to dealing with us, but what do you think the red carpet's going to be like tomorrow night? Um, you know, I haven't even really thought about it, but uh, I'm sure it's going to be crazy, and uh, this, this is great to be able to experience something like this. Who are you going to be wearing? <laughs> <laughs> Who am I going to be wearing? <laughs> um... No one, any, nothing, any, nothing too special, you know. <laughs> uh, my wrist is doing very well, you know. I've gotten back to benching, uh, you know. I wouldn't say it's back to full strength yet, but we're getting there, working on the flexibility. But uh, I mean, definitely no pain in it anymore. Just a little bit of stiffness, and uh, I mean, I would definitely be ready for the season. See, this time a year ago, hardly anybody knew who you was, were besides this team and your family. <laughs> now you're projected into the Heisman race big time and stuff. How is that, how do you compartmentalize that? And how has that kind of changed you? Uh, you know, just kind of think of it as part of the vision, something you, you dream about when you're a kid. And, uh, I mean, I've worked for it, uh, we've worked for it. My teammates are a big part of who I am right now, the slob, but definitely the, the biggest part. And, uh, you know, just got to thank those guys and um, just keep working. Do you peek at those projections at all? I mean, you see them on, on Twitter and stuff, but I mean, none of that means anything until the season comes around and uh, you strap up and get on the field. Zeke, how'd you get to be picked to be one of the guys to go to the SBs? I have no idea. Ask Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> Braxton was obviously hurt all last year. He's going on this trip. What do you think of Braxton being part of this? Uh, you know, I think Braxton's a big reason where we are now. And uh, I mean, Braxton was a, a very important part of the team two years before last year. and. Uh, I mean, this team wouldn't be where we are without without him and his leadership.